Hey guys, so this will be a bonus reading for Libra. I want to let you guys know that I appreciate you all so much. Thank you so much for all the likes, comments, shares, subscriptions, everything. Um, it means so much to me. As usual, guys, this will be a general collective reading, so this will not resonate with everyone. Please take what resonates and leave the rest. Um, but this could resonate with you if you have placements in your birth chart in Libra or you're dealing with somebody that does have Libra birth chart placements. Please take a moment to um, read through the description box, especially if it is your first time here. And if it is, welcome to my channel. I'm not offering personal readings at this time, guys. But don't forget to like me or follow me on Instagram if you're interested in collective readings. All right. So what do my Libras need to know at this time, Spirit? What's going on in my with my Libras at this time? Message for the Libra Collective. Message for the Libra Collective. Mm. Oh. I regret lying to you. So you guys are dealing with a gaslighter. You guys are dealing with a liar here. So, um rejection so this is somebody that could have blamed you guys for a breakup why they like wouldn't commit to you why they were breaking up with you why they ghosted you why they pulled back from you this is somebody that tried to blame you but this person knows that it was their fault they were the downfall of the connection of the relationship but they tried to blame you for it or try to make play victim when they know that you were probably the victim all right, this person lied to you about something here to try to make themselves maybe look better. Um, now this person's haunted by you. They can't stop thinking about you because they did you dirty. This person thinks that you guys are going to be together again in the future. It's like this person's realizing. So this person tries to like act like they don't. You guys could know mutual people. And when you're brought up in a conversation... Uh, they tried to act like they're not, like they're over you, like they're not phased by you anymore. They're not pressed about you. Okay. Um, or maybe this is somebody that tried to keep your connection a secret altogether, but, um, I feel like somebody was more concerned about their own interests. They were, they, this was somebody that was selfish. They were more focused on themselves than you or what was good for them. They weren't really thinking about how what they did would affect you. This is a person that's happening, having an epiphany after they've already wronged you in some way. They can't stop thinking about you now. Now this person feels like you are, that they do have true love for you, that you guys are supposed to be together. And this person's very, pretty confident here that you guys will be together again in the future. Spirit says that the fact that this person rejected you, they broke up with you, they ghosted you, that it was actually divine protection. All right. Um, it says, I am not available on the back of the deck. Hmm. Detached with love to clearly see the truth. So this is somebody, you guys maybe had a feeling that this person was dealing with a third party or that this person was lying to you about being single because we have, I regret lying to you. So this is somebody that could have been in a relationship, but they were lying to you about it. Or they still were over another person, but they were lying to you about it. Um, this person's not available in some way, whether it's just they're not emotionally available or they were actually like still dealing with another person. There was a third party, all right? And I feel like you guys were like trying to give this person the benefit of the doubt. You were maybe looking at this person through rose-colored glasses at some point, but I feel like you guys always had a feeling that this person wasn't being honest with you about something or that they maybe had somebody else, all right? Um, so it really, I feel like you guys really were able to see this person for who they, who they truly were once they, it's like, I see you guys coming to the realization that after, like, it was maybe hard that this person broke up with you, rejected you, refused to commit to you. That could have been hard for you at some point, but then you guys are going to like, you know, later down the line, or maybe even currently, you're going to realize that it was actually protection. Like it was best that you and this person didn't come together because they were involved with another person. They had a third party. This person was selfish. They're a gaslighter. This person's toxic. But guys, no, this person is haunted by you. All right. They can't stop thinking about you. It's because this person knows that they wronged you. They know that they lied to you. They know that they gaslighted you. They know that you did not deserve whatever it is that they did to you. Okay. 
Um, but this person tries to act like they're not thinking about you, but deep with like not even deep within them, like below the surface, this person's feeling very haunted by you. So we have the six of wands here. We have the four of swords. So somebody is very, this is a very prideful person. So this person knows that they have wronged you, but they are too prideful to be able to come forward and apologize or to take accountability here. Okay. So this person's not speaking to you, at least right now they're not. Well, then we have the knight of swords here. So this person may come in and communicate something kind of out of the blue, very shocking. Um, could be dealing with an air sign, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, or let's see here, the lovers. Yeah, it's like this person, you guys could be dealing with another air sign. Um, definitely could be a Gemini. Uh, this person's going to come in and tell you that they've made a decision about you, about this connection. Two of swords, but I feel like you guys are going to be guarded towards this person because you guys have had a realization about them. You guys are not looking at this person the same way. Tell me more about the two of swords. <laughs> yeah, they're going to want to come in and try to have this new beginning in love with you. But I feel like you guys are going to either like block their block communication with them or you guys are just not going to. You're going to block this person's advances. Yeah, it's like page of wands. You may be going to tell this person, no, you took too long to make a decision about me. Um, you took too long to offer me commitment or stability or to choose me. Three of Pentacles. What about Three of Pentacles? Yeah, this person was still dealing with somebody from their past. This person was still dealing with somebody from their past, possibly somebody that they have children with. Nine of Cups. Yeah, selfish. They're be this person wanted their cake and to eat it too. The Empress. Yeah, this could have been the mother of their children. Yeah, this could have been the mother of their children. Ace of Swords. They were confused between you and another person. They couldn't make a decision between you and like their baby mom, their baby dad, whatever it was. Um, but it's like now they're seeing something. They're seeing something clearly now. We have justice on the back of the deck. So this person is probably getting some karma right now. They're haunted by you. Now they want to come in and try to make things right here. Uh, but let's see here. Judgment. Yeah. They want another chance. They want to try to resurrect this, but we have the Eight of Swords. Yeah, this person wants to make it right. They want to try to reconcile now because this person can't get out of their head about you. Baby boy is just talking away, guys. He's fine. He's just talking. All right. And look, look, we have the strength in reverse on the back of the deck. This person's a coward, guys. This person, they're weak and they're a coward. This person wants another chance here but it's only because this person is getting some type of karma right now they cannot stop thinking about you they're very haunted by you they can't get out of their head about you strength in reverse we have the three of wands in reverse the hanged man yeah i feel like you guys are realizing that you don't want like you guys maybe wanted this person to offer you commitment you wanted something stable with this person but i feel like now you guys are realizing that that's not what you want with this person anymore or that this person is incapable of even giving that to you is what I'm seeing here. This person regrets lying to you. They regret what they did to you now because now they're getting karma. Now they want to reconcile and ask for another chance here. Mm -mm. Interesting, guys. Let's see what else is here. I feel like you guys are done. You guys are giving up on this situation. And I see a cycle closing out. Yeah, we have the eight of cups. Yeah, this is a done deal. All right, you guys are walking away from this person. You guys are fed up with them. Is what I'm seeing here. So, I hope that this reading resonated with you guys. Um, thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. You could take something from this reading. Personal readings are closed, guys, but don't forget to like and follow me on Instagram and Facebook if you're interested in collective readings. Uh, but other than that, I hope you guys have a good rest of your day, and I will talk to you soon. Bye.